So today we're going to have the presentations, the culminating projects for the Arts for Social Change project. My name is Erin Stevens and I'm a teacher here at George Harvey Collegiate where we partner with Vibe Arts. So for students um, at George Harvey to begin to look at the Arts for Social Change, it was really important that they understood who they were and where they came from. So we could start to tease out the ideas of what is part of their culture, what is part of their heritage, what is their ethnicity, what is their nationality. From there we went to jump into a project where they looked at themselves as though they were an iceberg. And the idea with an iceberg is you see usually a tiny bit what's above the surface of the water, but what's underneath the surface is the stuff that you never really hear about. They use this iceberg as a launching uh, like as a launch pad for them to go into and look at issues of social justice um, so that they could explore in the project that we did with Five Arts. Good afternoon visiting guests and fellow STEP students. My name is Nicholas and a part of our group we have Devin, Hassan, Ashley, Nathan and Khadija. We decided to focus our project on the environmental issue revolving around the decline in wild bee and honeybee populations. Reflect this issue by so the game and its plot about this bee named Bill, whose family is wiped out by the pesticide poisonings through evil scientists known as pesticide. Ha, ha. <laughs> it's an epic game and it features you fly throughout many different levels and balance things that would normally go towards the elimination of bees such as bearers or even farmers who use pesticides for their own crops. They also had to talk about why it mattered to them, why it was a social justice issue and who would actually relate to this in society. Body image is important because informing people of body image will help further diverse societal standards of beauty so that people of different body types, races, genders and cultures will also be seen as beautiful. This project shines the spotlight on gradually learning how to achieve self-love. Realizing your features is one step closer to loving yourself. Two groups in particular that were looking at how society views them. And our social issue project revolves around Black Lives Matter and party. So carding is a society issue because it's a form of um, institutional racism. Many young black men are being stopped or questioned by the police officers for no good reasons and they are being stereotyped negatively. Design is symbolizing black strength and the famous Black Lives Matter movement. Um, the meaning behind the fist with it being chained, the broken chain, is to compare the days of slavery to black today. What I did was that I went around to random George Harvey students. You could see Nicholas in this video, of course. Um, and I asked them just basic questions about Latinos and what they know about them. It was just really basic questions. And I was surprised by some of the answers. In the TDSB, we have courses like Native Studies. We have African History courses. However, we don't have Latin American History courses. And I always wonder as to like why we don't have that. So to basically like, to the TDSV, <laughs> this is what happens when you don't have that course. <laughs> Yeah, so the, the projects were really varied. And most kids would say, I'm not political at all. I don't like politics. I don't do that. And after a lengthy conversation, they then would start to explore it. So not only might it illuminate some of the contradictions, but it allows them to then engage in conversation with each other. 